Europe is the largest import market for CITES regulated wildlife, which demonstrates the scale of demand from European consumers. In an attempt to evade law enforcement, illegal activity has increasingly shifted towards the trade in non-CITES listed wildlife, including endemic European species such as songbirds. This is problematic because current policy responses do not adequately capture the demand from European consumers for European wildlife. The motivation for consuming illegally traded wildlife rests on the sense of luxury and exclusivity that the consumption and possession of illegally traded wildlife conveys. It is this underlying motivation that policy responses must address. And they can do so in two ways. Firstly, by being sensitive to the cultural context, for example, by running awareness-raising campaigns that demonstrate that contemporary legal activity is fundamentally different from traditional practices. And secondly, by complementing monitoring and enforcement activities with demand reduction campaigns that prevent the transference of illegal activity from one location to another.